That's sweet, isn't it? Three of them. Good morning. How are you doing, Sergio? Good morning. How are you? Good morning. 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 Batman stud. Come together. In your group right now, I would like the A person to tell the whole group at least one key idea in physics, one main idea in physics that you think is involved in this problem. <coughs> Did that answer your question? Yes. In your group right now, I want the C person to give that explanation to the entire group. The same explanation you just heard. All right, let's come back. Now I want everybody to do this. Look at the question, and I'm going to ask you to underline the word or words that make you know that energy is conserved in this problem. Word or words that make you know that energy is conserved in this problem. That's a note that I want you to write to yourself. Write it right on the problem. A note to self, write that. What's that mathematical strategy? Hold on, I just asked a question. What mathematical strategy do I want you to do when you know energy is conserved? In your group, I want the B person to try to answer that to the whole group. Now it's your job to find the energy. When I write E, what do I mean? What exactly do I mean by E? In your group, I want the A person to tell the whole group what you think I mean. All right, let's come together. Focus. For a moment, put the, put the pencils down. Stupid sticks go away. I want you just thinking. Listen to what other people say. What are the ideas behind centripetal acceleration, centripetal acceleration? Give me one thing. Give me one thing. Go. Uh, why do you know that? Give me an argument that would defend or refute what he just said. Defend or refute what he just said. Go. Hang on for a second. I want you to get Sergio's uh, thinking idea in your head, and I want you to get Maribel's thinking idea in your head. So let's start with Sergio's, then we'll come to yours. They're both right, but they're different. So give us your thinking again. Now, stop. Focus on him. He's about to give us his thinking. Listen to it. Listen and try to understand what he's saying. Go. Here's what I want you to know. Potential energy and kinetic energy. If the potential goes up, what has to happen to the kinetic? What if the kinetic goes up, what has to happen to the potential? Goes down. So look at me, do this. Potential up, kinetic down. Everybody do that. Potential up, kinetic down. I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna stop here with my lecturing time. I want you to look at the clock, it's now five after nine. At 20 after nine, that's 15 minutes from now, I'm going to come back and I'm going to expect you to have this problem solved or largely solved. If you cannot solve the problem, I'm going to expect from you some questions. So either I want from you at 920, either I want the solutions to each part and an explanation for how you did it, or I want a question for the part that you couldn't do. Does that make sense? So what's your job in 15 minutes? But if you can't solve it, have a question ready because we are going to start answering those questions. Okay, first of all, thank you. I feel much better today than I did yesterday. Anyway, seriously, I was frustrated. And I, I thought over and over again, I've got to get it better. You have to do better. And I think, how many of you also felt frustrated? Raise your hand if you were in that case. I agree. We were frustrated as a group. Today, how many of you feel better? Okay, I agree with that. I sense that from you. I appreciate the extra effort. Yeah. What's that? Okay, so write that down. Aha, uh -huh. I just realized that, right? Even if you think it's obvious, write it anyway. Sometimes the obvious things are the best things to write. What's this for? This? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm writing down before I ran this. Why? Yeah. Okay.